Good morning, my name is Austin. I'm a salesman here at Mercedes-Benz of Manchester. And thank you so much for your interest in our beautiful 2015 Acura TLX. As you can see, this vehicle is a beautiful white color. Underneath the hood, we have a 3.5 liter V6 engine. Looking at the front here, you can see we have full LED headlights. Coming around to the side, we'll take a look at the uh, beautiful Acura rims. And we'll look at the door handle here. This vehicle does have keyless entry. So with the key in your pocket, you can unlock the door simply by grabbing it and lock the door by pressing this button right here. Now moving around to the back, we'll take a look at the rear end of the TLX. Underneath this lip right here, you'll see we do have a little backup camera. Pop the trunk really quick to give you an idea of the space you have down below there. You can fold down the rear seats by pulling these levers here and here. And if you pull this, section up you can see you have a little bit of extra storage space down below there now moving around to the passenger side i'll open up the rear door so you can look at the beautiful brown leather interior looking up you can see this vehicle also does have the sunroof now moving into the front seat um, taking a quick look around here first we'll start with the center console i'll open that up to show you the space that you have in there you do as you can see have a 12 volt power outlet as well as an auxiliary cord hookup. Now moving forward you can see we have our two cup holders in the center console here. Looking at these, these are actually how you shift the vehicle into drive, neutral, reverse and park um, simply by pressing these buttons here. You can also Activate your parking brake by pulling that switch and activate brake hold by pressing that button there. Now looking forward, we do have a little compartment that you can open here. Now looking at that, that's just a little pad that you can put your phone on, just a little storage area. And then you can actually push that forward as well to give you access to another little compartment that holds another 12 volt outlet as well as a USB port. Moving up from there, we have just a few buttons here that you can use to control the infotainment system. As you can see, you have quick buttons here that will quickly bring you to these following menus. Moving up from there, we have our climate control settings. Looking at this screen here, this is a touch screen. You can use this touch screen to Turn on your heated seat as well as your passenger heated seat. You can change the radio station from that screen. There are a whole bunch of settings and information that you can access and change using that screen there. Looking up, you can see we do have a CD player in this vehicle. Now moving down here, this vehicle is push to start as well. So simply push that button with your foot on the brake and the engine will start right up for you. Looking at the steering wheel, we have two paddle shifters behind to uh, manually change gear. Looking at the right side of the steering wheel, you have your cruise control settings here. And if you look down from there, there's this little switch here that's going to turn on your drive assist functions, which include steering assist and lane keep assist. Now looking at the left side, you have a little switch here for your volume, as well as two buttons to hang up and answer phone calls, and another button here to activate your voice command feature. Now looking at the left side on the door panel here, you do have two memory settings for your seat position. 
That also includes the mirror. You do have blind spot assist in this vehicle that shows up right here in the corner of the door. That's gonna light up red when a vehicle is in your blind spot. And to change the seat position, there's a little set of switches on the side of your seat that are going to adjust your lumbar support, the height of the seat, how much the seat reclines, and how far forward and back the seat is positioned. Thank you so much for watching. Again, my name is Austin. If you have any additional questions, please feel free to contact me at 603-669-6788, extension 220211. You can also email me at alunt at driveprime.com.